I show the making of a theory film just before we begin talking about the evidence for evolution in my second year biology course. The film itself is 30 minutes in length and it's great storytelling about Charles Darwin. Students learn that he was more than just a collector of finches on the Galapagos Islands. Students also learn about the contributions of Alfred Russell Wallace, whom they've likely never heard of before. The build up to the end where we learn that Darwin and Wallace became supportive colleagues and not competitors always causes my students to erupt in spontaneous applause. Another reason I like the film is because Sean Carroll, the narrator, continuously reminds us that Darwin's evidence for natural selection is in direct opposition to the idea of special creation of organisms, including humans. There's a quiz that goes along with the teaching materials provided with the film that I have students work on in groups for a few minutes before showing the film. I like using the quiz as an anticipatory set because it reveals to them their misunderstandings as they watch the film. After we watch the film, we go over the quiz as a class, so the entire lesson fits nicely into a 50-minute class period.